It's like 20 degrees now. Yes! <laughs> Do we go... Well, we come from that way. Do we go that way? Or do we go that way? I think this way looks more interesting. And there's a lookout up there towards the sea. Gotta do it. Where did it go? What, the wasp? Yeah. Ah, it's only a wasp. Yeah, you would do the same. Yeah, I would do the same. <laughs> I don't know, it's gone now. You're right. Destroyed the piece. That's nature for you. Uh, I see. I like nature in moderation. <laughs> so what did happen then? The wasp tried to cut my trouser leg. Yeah. Wow. You see instant karma laughing about me. Shut up. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, we're going right now. Let's go to the lookout. I want to see the ocean. Are we stuck? We shouldn't have stopped near the top of the hill. Why not? Ah, I think we got it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it just suddenly got a little bit tight. discovered that our path was blocked 
this couple had got stuck in their Mitsubishi L200. Being only a two wheel drive, it was really struggling with the soft sand. So we decided to get the winch out and um, help them on their way. They were very grateful for the assistance and uh, with a bit of hard work and dedication, we managed to get the thing moving again and they were soon on their way. Continuing, we found this snorkel head on the track. Thankfully, it was not ours, but uh, we thought, why not? The spare is always good, you never know when you might lose it. So, yeah, we have two snorkel heads now. Next we wanted to go and see a secluded beach that we had heard about. So it was a short walk over the dunes and we were surprised with absolutely spectacular views. Not far from sundown so it was really really special to be up there at that time. We went for a walk along the beach, enjoyed the sunshine and yeah got some exercise <laughs> running back to the car. With the sun beginning to set, it was time to get a move on and try and find somewhere to spend the night. It was nice to meet some fellow overlanders on the trail, wave to them and then headed on our way. Soon we were rewarded with this amazing abandoned building along the coast, so we spent some time flying the drone and having a good look around. taken back today with how stunning the sunset was and the scenery all around us was just magical. We soon found somewhere that we would like to spend the night and we carried on enjoying the glorious views all around 360, the amazing red hills behind, the coast on the other side and it was just truly something special. We hope you are enjoying the Travel Overland series as much as we are. If you enjoyed this video, please do give it a big thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, then please consider subscribing. We would love to hear from you, so please do say hello in the comments. We will see you in the next one.